Basically, about what's really going on in the world. Really? What's mm. really going on in the world? What's really going on in the world? There's an awful lot of war that we shouldn't be in. I'll tell you what, there's fucking violence. Mm -hmm, there's a lot of warming, violence. And it's all going to turn to shit. Fucking ice. Is it really global warming? Yeah, there is. Are you sure? Because really? uh, there's an awful lot of scientists that actually disagree. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, have you been on a farm, living on the farm? No, actually, I... the last 10 years we've had a fucking drought, so... <laughs> That doesn't yeah, mean you know. that that's not a sign of global yeah, warming, you know, yeah. though. Really, it's not. No. So no rain is not a sign of global no. warming. No, a drought so, is not a sign of global oh, warming. Really Droughts have been happening. So, you go to uni, wait, wait, wait. Extreme flooding during summer. Droughts have been happening throughout. What the fuck is a sign of global warming? What? Well, did you know that for the last ten years the planet has actually been cooling? Really? Yeah, getting Are colder. You sure? Positive. Because if we stop, I'm absolutely. I can lights. show you. you I can show you evidence of the Antarctic ice growing getting thicker, the Arctic ice growing getting thicker. I can show you Himalayas not melting. I can show you yeah, icebergs all around the world virus. that are actually not melting. They because are actually they are the increasing. No, they're, they're not extreme. So if we stop everything that we're doing right now, the Earth would keep heating up for uh, over a hundred years. Did you know that the total the amount part. of... <laughs> The total amount of CO2 emissions that humans put into the greenhouse Look, gases is 0.7%. Oh point seven percent. Styrofoam. Fucking ice. 0.7%. That's how much CO2 we put into greenhouse gases. 99.74% is water vapour that comes from the ocean. 90%, 95% of the CO2 emissions that are in greenhouse, ga greenhouse gases actually come from the ocean. <laughs> no. <laughs> Thank you for the offer. We can bring your friend with you. No, but, but seriously. Seriously, global warming is a scam. Is it? Yeah, absolutely. Do you know who's going to be the biggest, um, who's going to make the most money out of global warming? Turtles. Al Gore. Al Gore is set to be the um, one of the world's first carbon billionaires. Do you know who Al Gore is? I don't know. Do you know who Julia Gillard is? Yes. She's the prime minister that got made prime minister because the mining people. And she's a ringer. <laughs> and she's a ringer. Said that the other cunt couldn't handle it. Is there something on my head? Look, Toy Boy. Oh yeah. Film that. Fuck yeah. Toy Boy. That. Now that's a story. Yeah, that's that nice. is a story. Yes. Fuck the global warming. Fuck the global warming, fuck the wars in the world, let's go to Toy Boy. I love you. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty awesome. I love you too. You guys are pretty awesome. You're from UWA, Thank aren't you for not hating me. No, even though I disagree with you're you. You're from Curtin. It's good that we can have a disagreement. Where are you from? I'm from Bunbury. <laughs> fuck. Okay, that's fine. Now we've got a disagreement. <laughs> How old are you? I'm a lot older than I look. You're 26? No. 25? No. I said All older. All I know is mining companies rule Australia. I'll say it, let's go. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Happy New Year. Thank you. Is it an art project? I'm glad it's so good. <laughs> is it an art project? No. Record that one. <laughs>
No, it's not an art project. So can I get your phone number then? No. You're pretty hot. <laughs> oh, thank so you. what's the message? Because I worship Jesus. <laughs> I don't. But I'm a nihilist that she, worships Jesus. She worships <laughs> and, the black um, hair that folds. And this the is my teacher. And the but Christ shoes. is my master. Mm -hmm. Though I'm an anarchist. <laughs> oh, and she's anarchy. An no masters, no slaves, no nothing. <laughs> except a total order. Oh, that's it. That's what I like. Random hugs from strangers. Beautiful. I'm going to give everybody a hug. Oh, yeah, cool. Oh, that is awesome. Hey, do it. Do the sign. Do the sign. I'm here. No, no, do the sign. You're going to have to go back. Go back a step. Take a giant step back. A giant step back. Whoa! Step back. Because I can't. Nice, guys. Hold me. So, what's your name? My name is Dylan. Dylan, and what are you doing down here, Dylan? I'm taking my friend from New Zealand out. His name is Storm. And why is Storm rubbing his butt against me? Because he's disgusting, <laughs> like the rest of people in Northbridge. <laughs> and so, um, so is everything okay, Dylan? No, everything why is not okay. Why is not everything okay? Because everyone hates everyone. This is true. This is not a good thing, I don't think. I think there needs you to be more love. You walk down the street. See, because I'm wearing skinny leg jeans, see like this, mm -hmm. everyone hates me. But they look hot. I know, but no one else seems to think so. Well, not in this place, they don't. Mm, yeah. So, you know, I hate so everyone. just because of your jeans? Seems uh, a little bit... Everyone, everyone's a bit, you know, unhappy with life. Like, Muslims and those. The Muslims leave the countries, or the Americans, Americans leave the Muslims alone? Point. Do you know the Point dictionary point. definition of terrorism? No. The dictionary definition of terrorism yeah, is apology. the means of uh, <laughs> war or military force to coerce a people or a government into okay. um, doing what you want them to do. Interesting. In the last 50 years, America has invaded over 50 countries. Do you know how many have or, or attacked over 50 countries? Do you know how many have attacked America in the last 50 years? Zeros. Oh, not many. Afghanistan not has. I know that. Do you know that? Osama do you Bernard really Paris know that? America. Did he really do that? Yeah. Was it? Was Conspiracy. it Osama? Who was it? The evidence was? actually points to a lot different. And if it was Osama bin Laden, why are we at war in Iraq? Why are we at war in Iraq? Why ain't we? Why are we at war in Iraq if Osama bin Laden from Afghanistan? Bombed the twin towers. Because he hid there. That's where he's hiding. <laughs> That's where he was. What, wasn't he in? He didn't live there. So, but is Challenge. is he still there now? No, he's no, dead. No. So why are we still bombing Iraq? Oil. Uh, because uh, oil. Is it oil? Has yeah, they need other people. Why are there babies being born with uranium deformities from the military weapons that are being used? <laughs> because it's part of God's plan. It, oh, it's God's plan, is it? God wants these babies to be born with deformities. You gotta learn from experiences. You gotta learn from experience? Okay, so it's quite acceptable for our armies to be over there creating these situations. Because these babies are going to learn from these experiences. Do you think it would be acceptable if your babies were growing up with uranium deformities? If there was peace in the world, you wouldn't be standing here right now. That's right. We wouldn't, we wouldn't know the difference. Sorry? We wouldn't know the difference. If there was war and non-war, do you know what I mean? It gives us freedom that we have today. But I want those Iraqis to know the difference. I want them to know what it's like not to have war. I want them to know what it's like not to have us in there shooting at them. God damn! Mm. This is my definition that everybody should just join the Mormon Church because everything has a plan. God <laughs> has a plan for us, and if you want to find questions and answers, read the Book of Mormon. Is everything okay? Yeah. Is it? Why is everything okay? Oh man, life's good. I'm feeling good. Oh, well, that's good. What is this for? Because I'm not so sure everything is okay. Really? Uh -huh. There's an awful lot of war that we don't belong in. There's an awful lot of babies being born with uranium poisoning and deformities from that uranium poisoning. Yeah. There are 
there is an entire country that are being forced into refugee camps. Their homes are being bulldozed. Do you have a religion or something? No. Um, I'm atheist. If you could call it that. I don't believe in any sort of God. It's good to have something like that, eh? Are you yes. religious? Yep. I don't agree with religion. It's another... Maybe that's the problem. No. Maybe not. Maybe that is the problem with the world. Religion. Different. What's the difference between the Muslims and the rest of us? The Muslims and the Christians? Say that again. What's the that? difference between the Muslims and the Christians? I'm not too sure I'm Muslim. Oh, he's cool! What is it? No, it's fucking cool. Is it? <laughs> yeah, That's good. Probably. Why is it so good? I'm having a good time. That's good. With nice people. That's awesome. Until That's five minutes ago. Sorry? Until two minutes ago. Yeah, until two minutes ago when my friend tried to convince this guy mm -hmm. who is homophobic to understand people. Mm -hmm. So... That's just getting worse and worse. But that's... Otherwise, it was good. We're just having a good time. Some, this is part of why I disagree with everything is not necessarily okay because we keep finding ways to divide ourselves. Yes, I know that. That's just ridiculous at the time. It is ridiculous. Everything is okay. Incredible. Are you filming? Yes. Are you filming? Yes. Oh, check it out, check it out, check it out. Or is it? Or is it? Oh, this is my mate from Denmark. Denmark, Jez, Jez from Denmark. Hey, Jez. I'm from Hungary. We're here on a little tour. What's your name, girl? My name is Linda, you but you me? sound very Australian for someone from Denmark. I grew, Denmark up, I grew up in Hungary. We grew up here, but and we lived there. I left when I was 18. So how long have you been filming this shit for? <laughs> All night. Uh, for about four. Four hours. Should, should, wait, wait, wait. This is a media No, no, project. no, no. Sorry, three hours. This no. Is, is this a project for no. you? Or no. Is this for fun? No, it's what's not a, for fun. What's it for? Everything's okay. Because I'm not so sure everything is okay. Everything is okay. So you're like a one man, a one woman fight for power. Type. So what's your That's name? Impressive. What's your name, Thank girl? You. My name is Linda. Hey, Linda. Hey, Linda. How you doing? Hey, Linda. Hey, doing? <laughs> right, we're going to go. Well, you know what? Keep doing what you're doing because we you. need more of that. Thank we you. need more of this Thank love. you very much. Can I give you a kiss? Here we go. Here we go. Everything is. Everything will definitely be okay. Pardon. Yeah, I've been standing wait, wait a minute and a half, nearly two minutes, and I've still not had any explanation as to what exactly is happening. Because I'm not sure everything is okay. There is so much going on in the world that shouldn't be happening. Oh, I know that. I work for a charity. I, I actually work for two charities. So yeah, you're actually talking to the right person. Yeah. Fantastic. Yep. Um, so what charities do you work for? Um, at the moment, I work for the Australian Conservation Foundation, and I work for Bush Heritage Australia. Mm -hmm. and. Previously, I worked for the Royal Society for Protection of Animals. Okay, so what made you do all that? Uh, I had obviously an interest in charity. I think they do fantastic work. Mm -hmm. And especially Whisper. I think Whisper are probably the world's leading animal charity. Everyone thinks of WWF, and I'm like, and I fall, and Peter, and I'm like, actually, if you look into the work that they do, Whisper are the best by absolute mile.